Hello, YouTube. Pope Grisco. Coming from Decatur, Georgia, as always. Today I want to do a quick little video about the religious observation of Lent. Um, this is not typically my uh, foray on this channel. But today, pipes and religion are colliding. Well, not today, but after Ash Wednesday, pipes and uh, religion are going to collide. Um, as we know, Ash Wednesday is coming upon us in a couple weeks away. Um, and well, if you haven't guessed already, I'm going to be giving up uh, pipe tobacco along with red meat um, for the observance. Now, I'm typically not uh, the most religious person in the world, although um, by practice oh, I am Catholic, um, but I'm, I consider myself more agnostic. Um, but because my wife is Catholic, um, and we go to Catholic Mass, I tend to, uh, um, you know, smooth things over by not fighting my wife's request. It doesn't hurt me at all. I'm more than happy to make her happy. So, uh, I'm going to say goodbye to my pipe and my tobaccos for about a little bit more than 40 days. Um, some people do practice the uh, uh, feasting on Sundays. but not my wife. So, I don't get any tobacco between Ash Wednesday and Easter Sunday. Now, I will uh, break that observance if we have a pipe club meeting. That'll be my one cheat. Uh, I don't think my wife will have any problem with that. Uh, she's not asking me to give up tobacco, just the red meat. Um, but I like to dry out once a year. Last year I gave up beer. Failed miserably. Uh, but two and three years ago I gave up tobacco. And with the exception of the first couple of days when I was a complete asshole. Um, I mean, it's fine. So, if you're giving a feeling for Lent, why don't you let me know? Or let the group know. I think it was always interesting to see what people practice um, and what they give up. Now, Easter Sunday, I do plan on having a very large feast of tobacco. And that's the second point in this video, is that I would like suggestions um, for tobacco just in general. Um, I'm still looking for a good vanilla aromatic and a good uh, uh, cherry aromatic. I'm anticipating on trying either McBaron's Navy, uh, sorry, McNairn's Vanilla Flake or their vanilla um, cream tobaccos. Um, I haven't tried those actually. I'm kind of surprising with um, you know how ubiquitous they are in the community. Um, but uh, uh, I am looking for other suggestions as well. I'm looking for a good uh, pre kaladakia blend. So uh, suggest whatever you may. They don't fall within those uh, perimeters. Still suggest it. Um, I like Virginia tobaccos. I like I like all tobaccos really. Um, I haven't found a McClellan that I like, um, but I haven't really smoked much of the McClellan tobaccos. Um, and if you want to use the shopping list from pipescigars.com, that's where I'm going to be buying my tobacco. I'm probably going to buy between, you know, eight and eleven different blends. Um, kind of stock up for the year. Um, hopefully, if any kind of uh, um, legislation increasing the cost uh, due to taxation on tobacco, hopefully this will be ride that out a little bit longer than I would be normally. 
But anyways, thanks for your suggestions, thanks for watching, and uh, happy smoking.